It's a nice day, tractor time. Here's the dealio, boys. I got everything hooked up. I got the clutch hooked up, I got the brake hooked up, got the shifter hooked up. My brake runs right along here, through there, and onto my brake system. And then the clutch is right here, which connects to my clutch pedal. So I'll have a hand brake, a hand, a hand shifter, and then a clutch on my foot. So now I'm working on the steering. Um, I have to lower the original steering uh, three and a half inches still. I already lowered it like uh, I would say seven or eight inches because the frame, you know, did the Z type thing uh, and I straightened it out. So, got to still lower it three and a half for this thing to sit level. So, here's my steering right here. Uh, gonna start hacking away at that. The thing with the steering is, luckily, I forgot it had a bend in it. I thought it was just straight, so it does miss the frame still. The only thing is, is when I do the steering, instead of having it well uh, down there, I'll probably weld it up here so that uh, this tie rod can get to it. Well, I gave them their first cut. Now I gotta give them the second cut. See what I'm doing here is I'm, I'm, I cut it and uh, I'm welding it on the opposite side it was on. So it's actually longer than, than it actually was before. That way I can get my tires farther away from the uh, steering. So at least where my first piece is, I'm gonna hold it up. Good enough for this side, and when I flip the whole uh, lawnmower over, then I can get the other side. But uh, now, that I, now that I got this one well done, um, I'm going to straighten out my wheel. Um, this only takes one whole revolution to turn, so half is right, right about there. And that's where I, I uh, welded this perpendicular to the frame. So now I'm going to go on that side and uh, see whereabouts I want to weld the other one, as long as they both stay in alignment. So that's how the first one fits. Fits awesome. Um, and I'm even probably going to put a washer there, so uh, it'll be, you know, another uh, 16th inch away from there. And then I'm probably going to do it like Junkstar does, and uh, take a bolt and weld it down to there, and then, you know, have a nut so you can tighten it down instead of uh, washers and a cotter pin. So it looks a little bit more, you know, legit. Check that out. Got it all welded up. Measurements are nice. And uh, the tire clearance is nice. Well, you guys, I'm getting dirty, I'm getting tired, and I'm getting hungry. So I think it's best to go inside while I'm ahead. But as you can see, she's low and level, so that's sweet. Uh, just gonna mess with the steering a little bit more, uh, make sure I like it, and then uh, probably getting ready to flip it over and uh, start working on the engine even. Um, and start getting these ponies a, a roaring and uh, you know take her for a spin maybe But she's definitely sitting low and built for tough Fuck you <laughs> 